So how are you how are you preparing for the season? I mean, obviously a couple of weeks ago, well, I say a couple of weeks ago, it might have even been a month ago now, I'm losing a bit of track of time, but you were testing up at Snetterton, you had the media day, you know, you're out in the car, you're getting a feeling of the car, and then suddenly nothing. How are you preparing for that? Well, it was quite an odd situation to put us into because pre-season is always absolutely manic. Um, yeah. That's when you've got the most of everything. Um, yeah. And going from being out in the car kind of four times a week on average, three times a week uh, to absolutely nothing. Uh, it was quite a difficult thing to, to kind of keep yourself um, going. Uh, it, just because you kind of felt like as soon as like, we started uh, isolation, it just felt like you were going nowhere and no one knew when it's going to start. You've got no real target. It's not like um, before this all started, you, I had a date in stone when I was first racing so I could m make sure that when I get there, everything's in place so I know I'm ready to go. Whereas now there's no real date still. Um, so it's just kind of keeping up and keeping on top of everything that I need to be doing fitness-wise, physically-wise, school-wise as well. Um, it is quite hard, obviously, like I said, because there's no actual target, end goal at this point because we don't have a date. Um, yeah. But it's quite hard, but I'm just keeping going.